What's up Star Wars fans and action figure collectors? We're gonna take a look at number 81 in the six inch black series line now. Uh, Padme Amidala from Attack of the Clones. This is another fantastic figure. Um, again, I don't have the SH figureized version to compare it to. They're both very different. Um, this is sort of pre-Battle of Geonosis, whereas the SH figure arts have got the one with the ripped shirt, um, the claw marks on the back. So more of an aggressive negotiations uh, mode. <laughs> Let's just say that. <clears throat> so we'll take a look at the back. Padme Amidala was a courageous, hopeful leader serving as queen and then senator of Naboo and was also handy with a blaster. Despite her ideals and all she did for the cause of peace, her secret forbidden marriage to Jedi Anakin Skywalker would prove to have dire consequences for the galaxy. Moving that box out of the way, let's get into the figure. Let's talk about some accessories first. And she does come with the droid blaster. Nicely weathered and detailed. She also comes with a swap out hand to hold it because the handle is quite a bit bigger. She comes with her little Naboo pistol. Which is very small and delicate and does fit in her holster which is which is always nice when you get working holsters and things like that. Um, so I've only switched these hands out a couple of times just to sort of see how it would pose up. And that joint is already incredibly weak, um, weak and loose. So that's definitely a little downside to this figure already. But I think that's as far as it goes. Um, I, I've, I know how to fix it, I will fix it. Um, just it sh shouldn't be that loose straight out of the box after a couple of uses, so never mind. Now we'll get a close-up look of Padme. We'll just tilt the camera up a little bit, there we go. So really nice, really good looking likeness of Natalie Portman. Who I've basically had a crush on since the Phantom Menace came out. Looks really good. Obviously this sort of shawl scarf thing is removable. But I'll show the figure off a little bit with it on. It does look really nice. It's the detail. It's got them, it looks really good. one off. Now this is a little bit tricky. It's a little bit tricky just to get over that get over that hair piece there. But we'll have a look at that as well. So really nicely sculpted. That's a separate piece. It's a great outfit, I really do like this outfit. Just the lines in the across there, across the top of the chest. The silver armbands look good, or the chrome armbands. The boots look great. And sort of utility belt, which is a loose fitting soft plastic that could be glued on for a little bit a little bit of a better look I might just do that a really nice sleek looking outfit and uh, yeah I really hope that episode 2 Anakin isn't too far away either so in terms of articulations ball jointed head ball jointed neck ball in shoulders elbows wrists that upper torso joint, ball hinge at the hips, swivels at the thighs, double jointed knees, and ball hinge in the ankles. So, full range of articulation for Padme Amidala. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this review and got through this one reasonably quickly. So, thank you very much for watching, and until my next video, may the force be with you.